Good day everyone. Uh, I am here today to talk on the topic living in Germany. My name is Victor Ojiabolo, one of the founder Nigerian Voice in Diaspora Germany. Uh, the topic is very interesting and broad because most of the Africans living here in Germany we, we find it difficult to accept the law of the land. First and foremost, we try to uh, differentiate uh, the law of the land and accepting the social web, the welfare. The two is inseparable. You cannot separate them. Uh, it is our uh, it is our it is our responsibility to obey the law. Obeying the law is sacrosanct. You must obey the law because you cannot uh, divorce one. Uh, because, for example, when you go out or you go to Afro shops, you hear a lot of uh, topics, and. Uh, that is why we, we said it is right to come out today to address those issues. Uh, if, you, if, you are, if you accept the financial benefit, you don't want to accept the law. It cannot go. My advice to you people is that you can't separate these two. You cannot be living in Germany and at the same time having the African mindset. It does not go that way. Uh, you see some of them, when they come to the financial aspect, they are happy to receive it. On the other way around, they tell you, ah, Germany, Germany, they cannot obey the law. Please, it does not work this way. Uh, parents, for example, they, when you go out, you hear, they talk about Kinder Gay, they talk about a Sion, they want to accept it. And at the same time, when they are doing wrong, the government is coming after them. They are saying, no, the government have no right to checkmate them. The government have no right to come to their house. The government have no right to discipline. Or when they do something wrong, they take their children. The government have every right. Because you cannot accept their money. And you, don't, you are not accepting the law of the land. It does not work this way. For example, let me even tell you, let me even shock you. The passport you are holding, let me use Nigeria as a case study. The Nigerian passport you are holding, if you go to the back side of it, go and read it. That passport, you pay your money to obtain it. You spend your money, your hours, your time. But it's also written there that it is a property of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. It is the same thing here in Germany. Those kids, those children, you have, you are only a custodian, they are not your children. Those children are children of the Federal Republic of Germany. So when you are not saying you are said the money, you don't, it's my children, it's my dad, please, I want you, I want to put a full final stop to all this today. For example, let me shock you. I have a friend who came from Africa. They were on a visit and the wife happened to deliver here. They were given a bill to pay of over 10,000 euro. Can you family imagine that? What we are enjoying here in this country? Even when, even mothers, when you are pregnant, from the day they give you a mother pass, the government is increasing your money for you to take care of yourself. They pay for your accommodation. They pay for your children's school fees. They pay for their health. Even from kindergarten to university, they pay all that. So I think uh, we, should be, we should be happy and grateful. And the only way we can tell the government thank you is to abide by the law. Because you can even take a step and go to your lawyer. I think every one of us here, as a responsible citizen, every one of us here, you are supposed to have your uh, uh, attorney. You can, if you can even take a walk and go to your attorney. We explain all this to you. And this is part of, uh, this is our responsibility as a Nigerian voice in diaspora. Because we help our people, the Africans, to integrate in this country. This is part of us. 
This is what we do. So, if uh, in case any any of you want to know more, our addresses are there. You can put a call across. We will educate you. In case you are finding it difficult or you don't want to go to uh, 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 a lawyer, we can educate you on what to do. So, for us to live a stress-free, uh, uh, for us to live uh, stress-free here in this country, please let every one of us do what is right, so that we will not have our problem, so that we will not have problems. We will not live where the way we are supposed to live, and we will be happy. May God bless you. Thank you.